Welcome to Besties Books and Brews, where we're not afraid to indulge in some steamy stories. So whether you are naughty or nice or somewhere in between, grab a glass of your favorite brew and settle it in with your favorite besties. Hey everyone, welcome back to Besties Books and Brews. How's everyone doing? Hey! Hey! So today we have something a little different. We are going to be playing Harry Potter trivia. Um, So yeah, that should be fun. You get to see how uh, nerdy we are. (laughs) So we're going to embarrass ourselves by knowing everything or by not knowing anything. That'd be me. (laughs) That'd be me. I'm not going to know a damn thing. All right. So before we get into it, what's everyone drinking tonight? I got my water in my Harry Potter cup. The boy who lived. I took pages from a book, burned them, and put them around. The yeah, she made that one. To Love Lori. that. That's gorgeous. It is. And we got the Gryffindor thing on the bottom. <gasps> nice. So we should introduce our houses as we tell say what we're drinking. Yeah, so. Gryffindor. <laughs> <laughs> so I, I I got a uh, Doctor Check soda, and, and I have oh, nice. my my water here, and I'm Slytherin. <laughs> nice <laughs> i have my water as usual and i am also slytherin slytherin pride i'll cover uh two birds with one stone by showing you this my water bottle <laughs> nice. which is my house have a a <laughs> and um my shirt says oh, boo you horcrux <laughs> <laughs> i love that I love that. <laughs> I am obsessed with that trait. That is adorable. I love it. All right. So we're going to be playing a round of, what is it? Harry Potter Trivial Pursuit. Trivial Pursuit. Mm-hmm. Yeah, perfect. Yeah. So we're just uh, going to ask questions from it and answer them, I guess. We'll, we'll, we'll try to answer them. <laughs> as I best as we can. <laughs> Trivial Pursuit has questions from both the books and the movies, I believe. And their questions get like, hard they get really so, yeah yeah <laughs> they get really hard okay so. here's what i'm gonna do i'm gonna like shuffle okay. them in front of the camera so you know i'm not cheating okay uh they love how she, she's also like, busy busy like, sponsor us yes please busy <laughs> while we're having technical difficulties <laughs> <laughs> And I was telling Alyssa that we look like we're um, wearing these to get rid of the mandrake sound. Yeah, we're at we're more at Hogwarts. Mm-hmm. Yes. So, <laughs> I'm gonna answer. I don't know what the answer. I mean, I'm gonna question. I don't know what the answer is, so that I could play along as well. Okay. 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 Perfect. And so, what are we? We're just shouting out, or we're gonna wait? Yep. Shout or out. yeah, like ask the question, and then we'll just if if you Shout know it, out. say it. Okay. <laughs> okay. Ready? Mm-hmm. Ready. What trait does Defense Against the Dark Arts Professor Umbridge accuse Professor McGonagall of exhibiting by questioning her methods? The fuck? <laughs> we started out strong. <laughs> We're weak. <laughs> um I don't I don't was know. Was she whoring? <laughs> no. No. Okay. I um, got nothing. I don't even yeah. have a thought um what's something you're not allowed to do in the wizarding world um show your magic in front of muggles that's what else is illegal that's a good question yeah what's what's one of her decrees (laughs) um (laughs) shall i say the answer yeah disloyalty Oh, we uh, you know what? Anyway. <laughs> that makes sense because she was yeah. so up Fudge's ass. Yeah, like, yeah, yeah. Okay, that makes sense. All right. Facts. Okay. Okay. <laughs> that was ready. What a yeah. fucking start. <laughs> All right. Doozy. What lines the Ministry of Magic entrance area allowing wizards to enter via flu powder? I didn't hear the beginning of the question. Oh, sorry. <laughs> Yeah. What no. Lori what said. lines the oh, Ministry wow. of Magic entrance are? Yeah. Mm-hmm. Okay. What lines? Okay, that makes more sense. Yes, chimneys. <laughs> okay. It it says fireplaces, but I'm mm. just gonna okay, give the point well, because same, it's yeah. same shit. Same, same shit. Yeah. All right. What creature is depicted on the stained glass window of the prefect's mm, bathroom mermaid. on the fifth floor? <laughs> yeah, mermaid. Knew it before you even finish. 
Mermaid it is. All right. Who turns back to help another competitor in the Tri Wizard Tournament maze? Harry Potter. Harry. It is. Man, Harry. I was thinking Harry, but I was like, is it too easy with that? <laughs> <laughs> For you, it's easy. In what room at King's Cross Station does Sirius Black give Harry a photo of the original Order of the Phoenix? God, I can remember it happening, but. I can envision it, but I have yeah. no idea. I don't know what conference room. Are there conference rooms in a in a train station? <laughs> I don't Bathroom? know. Let's see. The ticket booth. <laughs> there was there were seats, so kind of like a it, yeah. It's like the the like a waiting the loading area. area. Yeah. Like, let's see. A waiting room. Oh, okay. 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 What spell does Cho tell Harry she's never been able to perform before learning from him? Expecto Patronum? Oh, no, that's kind of like a new one. Uh, no, but I think that is what they were practicing, I, right? Yeah, I think that is. Yeah, I would go with that, yeah. The Patronus charm. The Patron, yeah. Uh, no, the stunning spell Stupefy. Okay, that was going to be my next <laughs> guess. Uh, okay, okay. <laughs> All right, new card. All righty. During his conversation with Tom Riddle about making Horcruxes, what number horrifies Professor Slughorn? Seven. Seven, yeah. Seven, yeah. That's how many yeah, to me. Seven. Okay. okay. I'm like, yeah. That was another okay. like, I'm like, is it two weeks? I know, right? Like <laughs> <laughs> seven horcruxes, seven right. books. Who disarms Albus Dumbledore becoming master of the Elder Wand? Draco Snape. Snape, oh. Snape oh. I think. What's because Snape gets it and then Draco takes it. I thought it, it was No, it's Draco. Okay. I think it is Draco. Okay. Yep, it's Draco. Okay, good job, Wilson. Yeah, <laughs> I had to think about that first. I'm like, wait a minute. Okay. Yeah, because wasn't there an issue with when Harry was describing at the end how like the how the elder wand went, like how he knew that it wasn't gonna go against him or something. When, yeah, he wanted he yeah, wanted in he... a duel from Draco at the mansion. Yeah, because Voldemort thought because he killed Snape, he was gonna have mm -hmm. reign over it, but it what he wasn't actually the like the yep. owner or whatever of it. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Okay. Okay. So, what type of creature does Harry speak to at the zoo during his visit with the Dursleys? Snake. Snake. I don't even have I'm to look at that one. Snake. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Which member of the Order of the Phoenix ex escorts Ron Weasley to the burrow during the escape from Private Drive? Kingsley? I don't know. I'm going to say Moody. I don't fucking know. <laughs> Take or a Tonks? guess. I don't know. Uh, All right, I'm, I'm saying with Kingsley. I Lupin. think it was Moody as okay. well. It was Sonks. Nice. Oh, okay. Wait, What's do you guys that? pronounce it private or privet? I say private. I I said private. Huh? But I think That's... but I think they're British, so I think it's private. We'll have to do another pronunciation. Mm. Yeah, definitely. <laughs> yeah, let's do an episode of that. Yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Well, I will tell you right now, I used to, because I didn't know what Hermione sounded like oh, before yeah. the movie. True. So I used to say Hermione. Same. <laughs> Hermione. Maybe Hermione. Yeah, literally. It's like all, hard to remember. All I picture or hear when I hear that now is that video where it's like, Hermione. <laughs> <laughs> oh, the, myster the mysterious that, the ticking puppet. noise. Yes. Yeah. I love that. That's a yes. now yeah. it's Now I'm never going to oh. be able to sleep tonight. Oh. It's going to be in my head all night. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> all right. How do Harry and Dumbledore magically travel from Hogwarts to the cave to look for one of Lord Voldemort's horcruxes? Apparate. Yep. yep. Apparate. Apparate. What is written next to the spell Sectum, Sectum Sempra in Harry's potion book? For your enemies. I think it's some, something like that. Oh, okay. Yeah. Yeah. I don't fucking okay. remember. <laughs> <laughs> oh, for enemies. That was close. Okay. Damn, yeah. that was really close. Yeah, good job. I always remember that. All right. Shows where my head is at, by the way. <laughs> <laughs> the Slytherin. The Slytherin. Exactly. Remember that one. <clears throat> All right. 
What is the motto for the Ministry of Magic underneath Voldemort controlled Minister Thickness? I don't understand the question. <laughs> okay. What is the motto for the Ministry of Magic underneath Voldemort controlled Minister Thickness? Oh, that was the minister's name. Yes. Mm. I have no freaking idea. I I, yeah, either. I wouldn't even. Magic is might. Mm, okay. Mm. No. I think those are book questions, like the first ones. Okay. That, anyway. That that definitely doesn't sound like a, a movie a detail they would have put in the movie. At all. Yeah. Yeah. All right. In Harry's third year at Hogwarts, what is the fastest broomstick in the world? Nimbus. Oh, the, 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 yep. Nimbus. <laughs> the Nimbus 3000. Right? I think it was no, the 2000? fireball. 2000. No, I thought because... the fireball came after the Nimbus, didn't it? Yeah, this is the third this year. Is the third third book though. So it's the Nimbus, then you had the Nimbus 2001. Oh, I thought I it was the Nimbus seen. 2000. Hmm. Oh, 2000. All right. All right. What's the answer? <laughs> Let's see. A fireball. Oh, oh good okay. Job, Lori. Okay. Yeah. Cuz remember, he gets it at the end. And that yeah, in, in yeah. the movie he flies off cuz he has his new broom. Oh, oh yeah, the okay. end scene. Okay. So yeah. I was thinking he got the fireball like way later. Oh, it was that was when McGon McGonagall gave it to him, right? Yeah, mm -hmm. because yeah, because they stopped playing Quidditch after that. Did they? He wasn't. Oh uh, yeah, well, no. then they I mean, had the they, Tri Wizard. They kind of <laughs> had it in the fifth one because that's when Ron joined, but by then oh. he already had the Fireball. So okay, We're really letting our nerd show yeah. here. But I haven't, <laughs> I haven't read the books in so like it's been many years. years. I need to do a reread soon. Same. Yeah, me too. Same. All right. What is the Anglo-Saxon term for man that forms part of the word for a man that becomes a wolf? Where? Where? I feel like that too. is the obvious answer, right. but I don't... <laughs> it's um... where. <laughs> oh, okay. oh, okay. Well, shit. Didn't know that. No learned. <laughs> okay. There you go. <laughs> For me, it was just like a process of elimination. Like, gee, what's a man that becomes a wolf? So where? And I know wolf. <laughs> yeah, I know wolf doesn't mean man. Okay. I mean, well, who often suggested to Sirius Black that he should become a dog permanently? Lupin. Was it? Lu yeah, oh, Lupin. Maybe it's because he was a werewolf and he wanted like a friend. Oh. All the time. <laughs> I was wrong. It was James Potter. Oh, damn. All right. But I remember, because I remember Lupin saying, oh, we often suggested that he, you know, make the change permanently or whatever. But I guess it was James I, I, I who said it first. I need to reread these fucking books. Right? Yeah. <laughs> okay. Where does the tunnel from the Whopping Willow lead? Into their, like, little clubhouse the with the... The Trump's shrinking shack. Foot. Yeah. Oh, oh yeah. yeah. No. <laughs> shack. yeah. I forgot there was an actual <laughs> name for it. <laughs> you said the playhouse. Clubhouse. <laughs> <laughs> they're, they're Mickey Mouse Clubhouse. <laughs> I forgot they had a name for it. <laughs> How many drops of Veritaserum does Snape say it would take so that you know who himself would spill his darkest secrets? One. Three. Three. That's I want to say one. Three. Damn. Look at you guys go. <laughs> <laughs> All right. What does Harry dream of the night the Riddle House Gardener is murdered by Lord Voldemort? When, uh, what's his name? Son was, um, oh my God. I don't know like exact terms for it. What was the Barty Crouch's son was talking to Voldemort when he was sitting in the chair? It's right? Barty Crouch Jr. Yeah. Okay, yes. Barty Crouch Jr. <laughs> <laughs> I remember the Barty Crouch part. <laughs> he was sitting in the chair and Wormtail was there. I know that Voldemort was like with them and I know Nagini was in the dream, but like Well, you're really they... you're really explaining so much of the dream and I guarantee it's like one or two lines. <laughs> <laughs> I know who was in the dream and they were killing the the house the keep the he gardener. Was, he, he was basically dreaming about the gardener being killed. <laughs> yeah. The gardener's death. Oh, oh okay. All right. <laughs> so, yeah. <laughs> okay. 
What does Ron order from the train trolley on the way to Hogwarts for his fourth year? The cho the chocolate, chocolate frog. frog. I'm trying Harry to think or if there's Harry anything. Harry orders the lot. <laughs> yeah, I'll take the lot. No, this is this is the fourth year, not the first. Oh well, shit! I still say chocolate frog. I'll say the sure. jelly beans because he collects the cards. Oh, we were all wrong. A packet of Drupal's best blowing bubble gum and a licorice wand, but he can only afford the gum. I was going to say that next. Never. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> okay. What is the most common way one becomes a werewolf? A bite? That's what I think, too. Yeah. Everybody in agreement? Yep. By being bitten. Okay. 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 Who mimics a werewolf's howl to save Harry's life? Uh, Ginny? Uh, Hermione. I think, I think it was, yeah, Hermione. Oh, duh. <laughs> it was Hermione. <laughs> Maybe Hermione. you need to watch the movies, too. <laughs> <laughs> I need to watch the movies, read the books. It's been <laughs> a long catch time. up on everything. <laughs> Where is Sirius Black held in Hogwarts while he waits to the mentor's kiss? Freaking shack. Oh no, he's in the the little, little jail cell thing cell. in the on top of the roof. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I don't remember that at all. Yeah, because then they, he flies Buckbeak up there to go get him. Yeah, yeah. it's the topmost cell of the Dark Tower. I had no idea it was called the Dark Tower. That's probably in a book thing. Yeah. Okay. What herb does Snape think Harry steals from his office to win the second Tri Wizard task? Gillyweed. Gillyweed. It is. Which defense against the dark arts professor teaches students about the unforgivable curse? Uh, the Snape. blonde guy. Yeah. Lup oh, it's Lup Snape? Lupin, oh. right? Oh, yeah. No, Wait, Moody. Was... Isn't it Moody? Oh, yeah, yeah Moody. he does it on the yes. bus. Yeah. It was Moody. All right. Which object left to Harry in Professor Dumbledore's will contains the resurrection stone? The right... In the, no, the snitch. The, the snitch. snitch. Mm -hmm. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. Mm -hmm. The golden snitch. That he had to, like, breathe on to open it, right? Uh, kiss it he or something? To kiss it. It or he had something. to kiss it. Yeah, he had to kiss it, because that's where he caught it. Yeah. Oh, yes. Okay. What does Ron try unsuccessfully to do to his pet rat on the Hogwarts Express? Catch it. Turn, turn it into turn it yellow. Color. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Always Turn running away. <laughs> <laughs> Turn it's... this big fat rat fat yellow. <laughs> Turn the rat yellow. Yep, change its color. <laughs> Which member of the order is killed during the escape from private drive? Who the fuck was killed? Was it Kingsley? Did he die? I don't remember. I remember Hedwig dying. I think that was just so like traumatizing it was. Wait, was was Hedwood considered one of the order <laughs> I don't think so but I don't think that's all when he died right did Moody die no he was alive in the end right I honestly that's a hard fucking no question idea. yeah I don't, know. I don't know Moody oh okay it was? yeah dang I couldn't remember if Moody died or not I couldn't either <laughs> I knew he died I just didn't remember where he died we said we love Harry Potter, not that we're experts, okay? Just putting it right. Out. Listen, if you had asked me these questions like a few years ago, I would have probably got every single one of them, but it's been way too long since I read the books. Exactly. <laughs> Just All putting right. that out there. The fact that I can answer any of these questions correctly is like, I'm like, whoa. <laughs> All right. The hospital wing at Hogwarts is run by whom? M. 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 Madam Pad... Madam... Matt, it's Madam something. Pomfrey? No. Yes? Pomfrey, yeah. Is it Pomfrey? Mm hmm Madam Pomfrey. All right. In the first practice session of the DA, Harry teaches the disarming charm. What is the incantation? Stupefy. No, wait. That was the... No. No, that's no. Not... Disarming. That's the... Expelliarmus. Okay. Expelliarmus. Yep. Yeah. Expelliarmus. All right, last the... card. All right. When Slytherin Draco Malfoy bets his fa Why did they have to say Slytherin Draco Malfoy as if we don't right. know who Draco <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, okay. 
When Slytherin Draco Malfoy bets his father that Harry won't last 10 minutes in the Triwizard Tournament, how long does his father bet Harry will last? One minute. Two minutes. <laughs> Seven minutes. I don't know. Ten? <laughs> Five. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> all right. Through all these movies, and I'm like, yes, that would be a good yeah, question. Yeah, that, that's yeah. a great yeah. question. <laughs> Here's this obscure fucking what, number. What color is the crack in the book. wall? <laughs> yeah, yeah. All right. Did, wait, really quick. Did you guys ever watch that? Um, they did like the Harry Potter trivia thing on TV. And one of the stuff. questions was like, yeah, they like one of the questions. They showed a video, and it was literally of like the floor mm -hmm. in. I think it was the chamber where Dolores was questioning Harry Potter, and it was like, where is this? Yeah, <laughs> it was a close up of it. Yeah, of the floor. I'm like, um, and then they did another one of the Dursley's couch, or no, like Hermione's parents' couch. Yes, was Hermione's like, parents' couch. What? Yep, <laughs> right. Which was a snippet in what? Yeah, it, yeah. I, I have yeah. the. And I then, have they, the... Th then they make her pick out which couch it was in person too. Yeah, out of those yes. three couches. Yes, I have the I have the Harry Potter DVD games, and they are just as ridiculous. It'll be like a blurry picture. And they're like, what's this? I'm like, what the fuck should I know? I see a big red blob. Like, yeah, right. But then there are people who do know that. And I'm like, okay, you just spent a lot of time. Way too much time. <laughs> watching and rewatching the Harry Potter movies. <laughs> okay. Uh, what does Cho Chang order from the trolley during Harry's fourth year trip to Hogwarts? We got another trolley question. Pumpkin I'm going, pasty. I don't know. I'm going yeah, I think actually that's again. it. No, I <laughs> it think was it, something I think with pumpkin. pumpkin pasty. Pumpkin pasty. Yep, two pumpkin pasties. <clears throat> All right. What grim shape does Harry <laughs> see among the clouds above the Quidditch pitch before entering, uh, before encountering a Dementor? A grim. <laughs> the what's the shape? Oh, a, 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 dog? a dog. A dog. Yeah. A dog. Okay. Which professor does Hagrid accidentally stab in the hand with a fork at dinner? What? <laughs> Somebody got stabbed? <laughs> Snape. I don't know. Who do you sit next to? Um, oh, no, no. wait. McGonagall. No. The, the, the professor Flitwick. Quirrell? Oh. oh, Flitwick. Okay. Yep, Professor Flitwick. I remember because like he was a little tiny thing next to Hagrid. Ah, uh, okay, okay. Good job. Okay. Um, where does Hermione use the time turner on Harry and herself? In front of Hagrid's. Um, it was in the field. Yeah, in front of Hagrid. Buffy. Yeah. In Wait, front of the hospital a, wing. It was yeah, the hospital. Yep, the hospital. Oh, wing. Yep. they it's show the up in the. Uh... Yeah. yeah, they show right. up over there. They go right okay. outside the doors and do it from there. Yeah. Gotcha. Listen, right. I'm, I'm just glad we're not taking shots. <laughs> I know, <laughs> right? I would have needed an ambulance right about now. <laughs> All right. The last question of the last card. Okay. Which potion that forces truthfulness is forbidden to use on students, at least until Harry's fifth year? Fair to Fair serum. To serum. Yep. Boy, that was a easy one. <laughs> well at least we ended on a good note yeah, yeah. <laughs> i could literally play this all night i'm just Seriously. Like, well, same well that concludes our game we hope you loved listening to our nerdiness and our sometimes lack of knowledge on harry potter <laughs> <laughs> next time we do this we will be better because we are determined to reread the book absolutely mm -hmm. <laughs> yes mm -hmm. So buckle up, wizards and muggles. Next week, we are going to be reviewing Six Scorched Roses, also by Carissa Broadbent, when we did The Serpent and the Wings of Night two weeks ago. Um, so this is the novella before the third book. All right. Well, then we'll see everybody next week, and we will review it and let you know what we think. Yes. Bye. Bye. Bye.